Okay guys, welcome back to Terra Nova Strike Force Centauri. We are doing a full-on let's play of this. Uh, let me just get us full screen again. Okay, that's probably much better for everybody. Look at all my beautiful medals that I have accrued. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and check real quick once again that we are recording. Recording looks good, and I'm just gonna have to take it on faith that it's gonna resize to full screen. Um, okay, so let's check our terminal, see if there's any unread emails. Centauri Council. I think where we left off last night was they had just, she was the, uh, Sarah Walker was the interim commander of SFC and now she's been officially promoted um, because of the death of Commander McPherson. Let's just check the news, see if there's anything. And I think the last thing we did was blow up that, yeah, we blew up that big lunar canyon. Which was an awesome mission, to be honest. And I was pretty proud that my strategy worked out. 192 kills, 33 assists, and 46% accuracy. But once again, Graciela... Is that how you say it? Graciela? Gomez, she is coming up strong on me. Um, she's definitely uh, killing me with these assists. So is uh, Malonis. Man, she's one of the most badass people I got on my team as well. 94 assists. Plus, she's a repair tech. And she's got 126 kills. Why the hell is she not a weapon specialist? I don't know. But, Stedman Mary. Did someone else die? Why do I, who, where do I keep getting these? Oh, because Sarah Walker's no. Yeah, she's commander now. And what's his face died. So, all right, Dewitt. I guess he's coming up. I don't really care for him. Ng did a good job on one of our missions where we had to take out that telescope. And um, my brother Brant App IO, he's doing okay. But he did a good job as the as the weapons guy. Gags did a pretty good job too, and he's got some good kills. He's probably one of the better people. Again, sort of that Rainbow Six feel to having AI that seems to be better at doing their job in the game than other AI. Um, and so they kind of endear themselves to you more, which is pretty cool. So without further ado, uh, enough rambling, let's get into the next mission. Let's see what it has in store for us. Okay, looking good. Auto turret, very nice. Demo pack. Use your eyes and your head on Sarah, Nick. The terrain is unstable that even the most recent surveys are inaccurate. Your nav map won't show you everything. Oh, great. Fantastic. Good. I got Gomez with me. Stedman, I don't... I haven't used her before. Uh, who else have I got? She's just weapons, right? Yeah. Who else have I got? Nobody else. She's like the only choice except for... Yeah, you know, that's it. I guess I can't bring anyone else. Alright, it's gonna have to be you, Stedman. Heavy suits for everybody. Alright, outfit complete. Let's do the drop. Okay, so I got my squad with me. First of all, I'm gonna keep them together. I like constant, you know, and, and a lot of people would be like, no, fan out or send them to different spots and stuff like that. Yeah, but here's the thing. Individually, we are, yes, more targets to hit, but also very fragile individually. But if we're having concentrated fire or I'm shooting at one guy and my other guys are concentrating at others, we're kind of like a, 
sort of a phalanx, like a wall of of uh, heavy firepower. And I'd like to keep it that way. I seem, I seems that we're more effective like that. So there's our pickup point. Atmospheric processing. All right, now let's just check our objectives real quick. Uh, destroy abandoned base, destroy abandoned base, and all foes. Okay, just go in and blow everything up, I guess. I'm gonna tell everybody to get hard. And we're gonna go ahead and set Seems that we're moving together. That looks good. I'm going to stay with my particle beam to deal with personnel, but when it comes to buildings and stuff, I will probably switch back to, uh, uh, or switch over to a missile launcher. Oh, we're just going to check options real quick. It was looking a little pixelated there. That's just the game, but trust me, 300 by 400 is way better than 300 by 200. <laughs> So I think this is what they were talking about. Uh, hold on, let's just look down real quick. Oh no, there's the base. Research building out of range. How about this? Still out of range for that. All right, let's do it, guys. I told my guys to go ham, so hold on. I'm gonna get my uh, missile launcher out for. I'm just gonna use a missile launcher. Screw it. Oh shit! Oh god! I got people behind me. Oh my god! All right, we're gonna stay in formation this time, and you know what? I'm going to use a similar strategy that I used for the last mission. What we're going to do is I'm going to lay down a shitload of auto turrets, uh, turrets and they are going to come to us. Um, and then we can just take out the buildings. I'd rather draw them out, especially since we have high ground and we're going to fire down on them. So, um, yeah, I was pretty happy with what everyone had. So let's just do that. I'm just going to skip the little video here. All right. So hold on. Stay in formation. Follow me. back on me real quick switch to my ASF here all right so that I can drop as many turrets as possible we're gonna go about halfway down the hill drop turrets I'm gonna target my missile launchers on those tanks to get them out of there and then as enemies come up to us we're gonna stay together and you know what if this keeps getting bad I'm actually gonna swap out uh, Stedman with uh, my repair tech not only does she have a good kill record but uh, also she is she can repair us um, and I can command her to like keep us repaired and stuff like that also we got flanked from behind because my guys just went in like crazy and I told them to go ham but I think they went they got a little overzealous if you guys noticed so we're gonna proceed a little bit further I'm gonna start dropping turrets That's done. Particle beam. Everybody stay together. And just snipe them from up here. Just make them come to us. It's way better. Plus, I can snipe from with the particle beam from out here.
How we looking, guys? I see how many turrets I got. I've got, I got five turrets left, so we're gonna go in. And I'm just gonna check the resolution again. This is looking very grainy. Okay. Got us. All right, hold on. Going to ASF. Nice, dude. This auto turret is like <laughs> seriously a game changer. This is awesome. We're gonna go straight up the hill and hold on is everyone with me just make sure you guys uh yeah yeah follow me these jump jets are fucking awesome you're so high oh, I forgot we're in heavy gear so it's gonna be Okay, I'll just wait for them to recharge. Come on, everybody. Follow me. I didn't have enough forward momentum that time, so. But we should be good now. Let's go to the point. Oh, we didn't even need to go up the hill. What was I doing? I don't know why I'm moving so slow. I mean, I know I'm in the chunky heavy armor, but like, I'm really moving. Like, as if the the run button isn't working or something. There we go. I just needed to be on level ground, I guess. It's freaking out. Roger. Nice! Mission accomplished. Oh, man, those auto turrets are just boss. So I was looking into it, apparently there was a, a sci-fi novel tie-in to this game that was actually published, because they were going to make like a whole series out of this, but whatever. I'm sure the Hogs will be disappointed to learn that they do they not only failed to get the station, but that their squad lies in ruins. Of course your squad isn't in the greatest shape after the, either after that assault. Still, that was some nice work, Nick. Okay, Stedman's her, and she was the most inexperienced. She probably didn't follow my orders. All right, we're gonna save over phase two. Okay, done. Nothing new on my terminal, that's weird. Let's see how that went. 201 kills, that did bump me up. That was only about 10 kills though. And Gomez didn't get that many more. She only got about seven. Um. Still, very nice job. Let's see what the next mission has in store for us. Good morning, soldiers. Let me get right to the point. We've been transporting receptors from the plan on Thatcher and the rest of the Centauri system via lift off port 7. The parts are first moved via trucks from Ziegler Steady to LP7 for final shuttling to intersystem installations. Well, it seems our friends have learned of the base and intend to cut off our supply lines. Nicola will head a squad, charged to move from the drop-off point here, to meet with the convoy moving southeast and protect it from assault. Be sure to escort the convoy all the way to the base. I don't want anyone getting soft and stopping short. The shuttlecraft would also appreciate the extra defense. That's it. Now make it snappy. 
lift for the batch of leaves in 30 minutes. Dismiss. All right. SIR Mark IV. Built by Clan Ganymede's Soul Island Research, the discharge. The Discharger emits a cone-shaped pattern of ion streams. Nearly all conductive targets within the area of effect suffer extreme electrical damage. Warning, the emissions from this system are not selective. This weapon should not be fired while friendly units are near the target. Okay, interesting. When they are, We don't know how many hogs are coming to this party when they'll ar or when they're all arrived. Stick close to those trucks, soldier. We need at least three truckloads to make it through. Don't neglect the ships, however. If you lose them, the shipment can't go through. Protect them both. Ugh, protection missions. And I do not want Stedman on weapons. I want Gomez. Oh, I don't think I'm going to use this ionic fusion rifle. I'd rather go with a particle beam. All right, let's see how this goes. Oh, my favorite song in the whole game. Alright, so let's see what I'm supposed to do. Uh, escort trucks too big. Okay, I guess we go to the pickup point? I'm not really sure. Just everyone stick with me. Oh no, that's a... Pff, never mind. We gotta go up the road. to find the uh, trucks and then escort them. Well shit, what the hell? All right, I guess we better move faster next time. I don't know what the <laughs> I don't know what that was about. I do like that uh, you can issue commands while you're falling so that uh, you can you're not wasting time that's actually in the mission you know what I mean issuing just a few commands and stuff Gomez, take care of it. Nice. What the hell is that? Somebody's shooting over here. I see you there. Nice. All right, let's follow the trucks, guys. Move, move, move. Really would like my shields back up, if possible. What? Oh, you know what? Let me try this. Following. 
So we're going to try, me and Gomez are going to try and intercept the trucks. They're going to go down there and take out anything that shows up there. Because I think that's what's going on. They're, the enemies are showing up in two places at once. God damn it! Okay. Movement. Uh, move here. Go to the base. Movement. Move here. Go to the base. Movement, follow me. We gotta go fast. This is like, there's zero time on this. I may have to look up like how to do this because this is starting to piss me off. All right, so. All right, make sure those guys try and hold the fort down over there. We're gonna go take care of this stuff right here. Now we're going over here. We're gonna take out these pirates. Just fight them off, guys. I can't be in two places at once. You're gonna have to deal with it. Oh my god! Is there a mission skip? Cause this one, like, this one sucks. This one really sucks. to go like immediately I am there Incoming drones Now I'm just going to run straight down the road over here and go behind the trucks and put the drones on the road Alright, now I'm gonna follow the trucks. I'm gonna run down to the to the base and see if we can't kill those things. God damn. What in the fucking fuck, dude? Alright, hold on. I gotta look something up, guys. This is crazy.
So this is what the little guide I'm using said. Uh, I'm not using a guide for the whole thing, but I just uh, looked something up real quick. Just because this is really a pain in the ass. Okay. Do what they said. Two auto turrets here. And then I'm running here, going fast, going fast, going fast. I'm gonna lure the drones over here and see if the auto turrets aren't gonna take care of them. Okay, now I'm gonna run to the base and make sh sure that I can help my guys and the trucks. It sounds like they, it's a, I just had to send them to the right spot, they intercepted. Um, so far I'm doing okay. I just need to make it to the base and protect the trucks. And I wish I could run just a little bit faster, but I'm in heavy armor, so. Alright, fuck, yes, finally. That was the one time that I needed a guide, like really needed a guide. But it worked, so we're gonna put a point here. I'm gonna call on my guy. Tell everyone to get their asses over here, and we're gonna get out of here. Cause I don't really like this mission. I mean, it's not it's not bad once you have it set up properly, but still. But see, I almost had the right strategy. I was trying to send one squad to protect the base. It's just that they, what they needed to do was intercept the enemy, not try and protect the one base. Nice, finished that one. <laughs> I'm the only one who got hurt. Uh, superior job, Nicola. I couldn't have asked for more. To have fended off that assault is no small task. Thanks to you, we've supply lines running and the receptors are presently being set into production. Nice. No medals? Come on, man. Not getting emails anymore either? No news? Two hundred ten kills, very nice. One fifty two for uh Gomez. Yeah, Gomez is just kick I'm so glad I brought her on that mission instead of what's her face. Steadman. Sorry to break up your tea party, soldiers, but it's crunch time. The med convoy heading to Silas Steading has been waylaid. A small hedge force has blocked the med trucks with the landslide and has begun their siege. To make things worse, there is a brigade of hog mechs here fast approaching to assist the assault. Damn. The convoy is stalled here. However, to reach the convoy, the mechs will have to cross this bridge. If you can destroy the bridge before they arrive, the mechs are no longer a threat. We'll drop you here near the bridge. Nicola will lead the squad, and I want a demolition specialist along too. So here's what I'm thinking, guy. Two weapon specialists, heavily armored, uh, and with good... Uh, no more Steadman. Gomez. Demolitions. He did okay. I'm gonna go with my brother, though. 
I don't need an electronic specialist, so what I'm, I'm gonna do is bring... Her, with her pair packs, uh, heavy suit, particle beam, particle beam, particle beam, particle beam, missile launcher, ionic fusion launcher, grenade launcher. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drop in, send my demo guy to blow the bridge immediately, then we're gonna hightail it to the uh, intercept point, and we're gonna face off against the forces, and yes, auto turrets for me. Nope, she's getting auto turrets as well. Okay. Your call squad leader. If Malonis doesn't work out, I might actually swap in Stedman and give her auto turrets, and we'll go with that. He did pretty good job demolitions last time I used him, but we'll see. Alright, so it, if it just didn't take so long to issue commands, um, but I could try the F keys, although I'm afraid of using the F keys with the... I'm gonna use the... Oh my god. Let's go guys. Come on. Let's go! <laughs> I can barely move. Alright. There we go. You just need that little bit of forward momentum to make the jumps worth it. This music's definitely reminding me of... Uh, Up! Oh, drop turrets! Drop turrets! I'm out of, out of turrets. I hope we don't get screwed by this uh, decision, but damn it. Oh, Gomez is down. Damn it. All right, let's stick with the trucks. So I'm having her repair my suit. It was kind of a good call to bring her along so far. Can't believe Gomez died though. Damn it. So I demoed the bridge. 
So we should be... It is better, thank you. I just wish I had some more auto turrets. I think I kind of went a little uh, crazy using them before. Hopefully the base is nearby. I just want them having a tighter formation. I'm getting a little sloppy right now. Get the f I have no idea what's going on. Guys, take him out or something. We need to get out of this damn. Yes! The plan worked! Except that Gomez died, but that's fine. Sweet, we did it! Okay, so. Make sure. Everybody's following me, and let's get the hell out of here. <sighs> yeah, I had absolutely no other hell idea what the hell was going on earlier. I was like, oh shit. I mean, I assumed they would attack through there, but... There wasn't much I could do. Oh, our drop ship's already there. Great, I don't have to call him in. Because I totally forgot to just a few seconds ago. Roger, squad leader. Gomez hurt. Okay. Great space. That was brilliant work, Nicola. Even I had doubts about you getting that convoy through. I'm glad you have. I've been proved. I'm glad to have been proven wrong. My illiteracy is creeping up again. No medals. You guys are getting pretty stingy with those medals. I think that deserved a medal. I mean, I did get a person killed. Not killed, but she's hurt. New terminal. News. Command plans recapture of McDonald Station. SFC Command Staff and Strike Force Slade are planning the recapture of McDonald Station, which fell to the hegemony earlier in the war. Station Commander Deidre McLaughlin said that the hegemony's strategic focus upon Thatcher has left the outpost vulnerable to recapture. While most of their units grind away at Thatcher, we at least have the opportunity to free up this part of New Hope, she stated. We figure now is the time to strike. While the station is only moderately defended, SFC Commander Sarah Walker said she was hopeful, but that Centauri forces were needed all over the system, and that we're not sure we can manage a proper assault yet. McDonald, McDonald is heavily protected by gun towers, which will make its re recapture both expensive and bloody. I can't imagine what we're what our next mission is. So when I said establish radio contact, he thought I meant touch it. Sarah. That's Commander Apio. 
Maggie, I need to speak to you. Huh? A woman who can't even look me in the eye? There's a reason for all that. Move along. He stays. <laughs> We're never alone anyway, right? There's no right way to say this, Maggie. I know where your family is. The Acid Hand Pirates waylaid the transport full of hibernators. Your husband, your kids, they're being kept in a base on the Saratoga continent. I've known for months. What? Listen to me. I couldn't tell you. Our clan was forced to deal with the pirates. We were starving. And my kids paid the price. My mother ordered me not to tell. Because if I knew the truth would come out, then the council would know that your clan sold its soul for a hot meal. That's not how it is. That's why you killed the clone. Just in case it knew something about my family. Just in case it knew about your mother and your goddamn clan. I'm right, aren't I, you bitch? Now that I'm commander, we will go and get them. I promise you. Your promise means nothing. Maggie! I guess I deserve that. The plot thickens. Very nice. I hope Gomez isn't out for this one. I'm gonna need some capable people. Okie dokie. Let's go get this lady's family back. I'm surprised McCullough doesn't want to come. I don't need an electronics guy. McCullough's away on mission. I guess that's a conflict of interest. Um. Ugh, Gomez. Damn it. Alright, Stedman, it's time to prove your worth. We're gonna try with DeWitt. We're gonna give this guy a chance. Sir Mark IV. Missile launcher, missile launcher, missile launcher. Particle beam, ionic fusion, thermal disruptor. Auto turrets. No, auto turret, please. And, uh, alright, let's, uh, let's give it a shot. I may swap him out for Malonis for suit repair, just in case. I think this is a pretty straightforward attack, but I'm not sure. All captors. All right. So, where's our attack point? Here's the farmhouse. Roger that. Everybody, follow me. I'm gonna switch to the auto turrets because I don't know what we're gonna run into up here. So. Come on this way. Come on, buddy. Buddy, come on. That doesn't mean anything. Squad 
the fu- Alright, well, we're gonna stay away from that farmhouse, then. Let's try it again. Alright, so... Alt-M. Drop turret is what the command we want, and we're gonna stay the hell away from that farmhouse. So we're gonna try, yeah, we're gonna try and shift the tide of the battle out towards the hegemony supply uh, depots and stuff, away from all the civilian buildings. What the fuck is that? Alright, I better just keep an eye out for... Guys keep shooting me with those damn shock pistol things. Drop one more turret here. I might. Nice! We did it! Very cool, very cool. Good work. There is some. You know, it's not like incredibly deep or anything, but there's some tactical thinking that goes into doing this thing, which is cool, because it's like, all right, uh, they're going to use explosives. We need to stay away from the civilian structure structures. And also, I'm going to herd them towards my sea of auto turrets. Oh, did I forget to call on the guy? Nice. Sweet! Another successful mission. Yeah, I'm the only one who got hurt. This was obviously a very difficult situation for all of us, especially me. And I'd like to thank you personally, Nicola. Freeing Maggie's family may not be an important strategi strategic victory, <laughs> strategio victory, uh, but it's a tremendous personal one. Very fantastic. You have been awarded the New Hope Laurel. Nicola, your courage and determination in saving Maggie's family has earned both her gratitude and the respect of those at command. Command is proud to award you the New Hope Laurel for service above and beyond the call of duty. Nice! Check out my medals again. Look at that. I'm missing what, two? Wait, probably uh, two or three. I'm surprised I didn't get an email from Maggie saying like, hey, thanks for finding my family. Trouble 222, all right, sweet. Station. If we can get 
get an electronic specialist in, we can tear into the code and have that tower sending all clear signals out to the guard sensors. That's right, you can still be seen, but their suit sensors will be next to useless. While the troops are resting on their laurels, Nicola, I want you and your team to sneak in and plan a demolition charge on the tower. But be careful. Not only does the station house have guards, but once you hit the tower, the hogs are gonna come running like it's slot time. I want all of you coming out alive. As a secondary target, you may want to take out the control station after the tower's been destroyed, but I leave that to your judgment of the situation. Best of luck, soldiers. We're counting on you. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, this seems a little complicated. So I want an electronics guy. Rossi's no good. I want uh, Gags. He's on a mission. Oh, I guess it has to be Rossi. All right, demolitions. I need two demo guys. All right. I'll try the Sir Mark IV, we'll see. Uh, let's give it a try. Reprogram station. So I guess we'll follow them and provide some backup as they take care of the control station. I think the control station's down. I don't think he can do anything. Well, we're going to see what he can do. I think I might have screwed that up. Let's check this out. Eight. Uh, destroy the tower, destroy the tower, and the control station. Okay. Let me go to Rossi. Special. Okay, well, the station's down, and it's a destroyed. Okay, so how about this? Just everyone follow me, right? We may have to rethink this one and, and try again, try another drop. I think I screwed that up. It just means we are going to have more opposition going up to the tower, but I don't really care. Hold on. Are my guys even with me? What did I say? I said, follow me. Oh my god. Maybe it is a little bit too much. Hold on.
Okay. Still have a full squad. Alright, let's wait for all this to heal up. I may bring a repair tech next time instead of a... Uh, a second demo guy. But at least I got two demo guys in case of... What the hell is that? Oh, shit. Get back to the auto turrets. We're so screwed, oh my god. Range? What's going on? Oh my god, we're so screwed. Is that everyone? Stay to the auto turrets. Yeah, that's what you say now. That was a lot of guys. And a bunch of mechs too. And half my squad is dead. Let's just, uh... Let's just take a breather for a little bit. It was a pretty intense firefight. And I'm out of turrets, so... Let's hope to Christ they either come out here and try and face us, or we don't have to deal with them anymore. Come on, suit. You can recharge. Or maybe my front shield is down. Let me see status. I'm pretty banged up. Oh, that's why my front armor is totally screwed. Let's just hope we did enough, we thinned out the herd enough to get in there. I doubt we did though. I'm sure it's got its own like, getting crazy defenses and shit. Demo the tower. Pick a fuse. Let's go. I'm going back to the uh, the things, and he can follow me there to the auto turrets. Once he places the charge, we'll demo it, and then we'll get the hell out of here. Get clear and then detonate those damn charges. So that was pretty hairy. We screwed that up royally, but hopefully there's no more enemy whatever we need to just get the hell out of here where the hell is the drop ship because we're gonna be so screwed if we get uh, caught with our pants down right now come on buddy yeah let's go land and just push me out of the way 
That's fine too. Yes, we did it! And I sort of have one guy left alive. That wasn't so bad. I just, uh, I totally screwed up the whole way they wanted you to do it. But whatever. Who cares? <laughs> Everybody's hurt. <laughs> With that tower down, we've been blitzing every outpost that we can find. SFC have flashed enough buildings to set the hogs on a running frenzy. In a running frenzy. They don't have anywhere to hide. Their only limits are time and ammo. And you've even took the control you even took out the control station while you were at it, despite taking a beating from the enemy forces. Good work. No medal for that one. Gonna save again here. I'm gonna save over phase three. Nothing in my terminal. Terminal. No even, uh, like, thanks from What's-Her-Face for saving her family. Alright, give me uh, one second, guys. Gotta pause the recording for just a second here. Okay, we are back. Recording again. Just checking the recording. Everything looks good. Okay, so I'm gonna go back to... Okay. Probably a cutscene. Oh, shit. <clears throat> 240. I think I got like 30 kills on that last mission or something crazy like that. Wow. Yeah, I kind of pulled ahead of everybody else there pretty, pretty abruptly. Isabella de Francesca. Is that how would you would say that? De Francesca. De Fon I think it's de Francesca. Uh, de Francesca. Yeah. Anyways, doing pretty, pretty well. All right, let's, uh, this tram doesn't do anything and there's nothing else to click on. I wish there was a little more interactivity in the home base here. The magnetic ballistic cannon combines a magnetic induction launch system with a chemical fuel engine to propel an oversized explosive shell over a great distance. No other PBA system is capable of causing the damage this monstrous weapon can provide. The MB cannon's stabilizing mechanism is still experimental, so the cannon will only fit the heavy suit. I guess I'll try that one out. Two demolitions, that seems good. Recon. Uh, I want... Gomez on weapons, heavy suit. Particle beam, and I'm going to give her the MB cannon as well. Personal shield, I suppose. You'll need a demolitions expert to pull this one off, so pick your squad accordingly. And beware that McDonald is crawling with hogs. Once the alarm goes up, they'll undoubtedly start pouring out as the central base is 
of the central base boat, so be careful and take out as many towers as you can. Try to get at least three of them. Alright, we're gonna see how difficult this is. I may want that damn auto turret. Sorry about that, had to pause the recording for a second. Okay, so, let's see where this damn... Gomez, you follow me. Right I have a feeling that the MB cannon... So I did northwest and southwest. Let's try southeast. I have a feeling that the MB cannon will... Uh, destroy buildings. I forgot to give myself a, a pulse rifle. We'll just take out the thing first. Let's plant the charges and get out of there. Alright, that didn't work. Let's uh... Alright, we're gonna go ahead and abort mission. Plus, I didn't have my- I do not like that stupid ionic whatever thing. So I'm gonna try a different one. So, replay mission. Bio, heavy suit, MB cannon, MB cannon. So, the MB cannon doesn't do- we still need charges, so that kind of sucks. So, uh, I don't know why I'm gonna use it. I guess I'll use it to shoot at whoever, and I'm gonna change this to the particle beam. Or we're just gonna move as a squad and try and take them out one by one. I forgot to get the auditor. Oh well, we'll probably fail again. <laughs> okay, I'll have a chance to get it then. Nothing better than watching a seven-story fuel tank exploding in the darkness. I guess so. So let's go ahead and all follow me. So I'm going to send Ng over to, what are we at? Southwest Tower. Sir, sending charges to blue fuse. Oh, I see why you would have different color fuses. Never mind. So that you can blow up things at different times. I don't know how necessary it is, though. Alright, that MB cannon's pretty bad. Badass, I can take out mechs with it. Are you serious?
Alright, we're almost dead. So the auto turrets would absolutely help us right here. We can just do what we did on the moon and just and just draw everyone out. We may still be able to pull this off. I'm glad I sent the other guy for that one, but we are going to need... Oh my god! Hold on, let's just get this out of the way. Special demo Northwest Tower, please. Oh shit, they're gonna annihilate him. Yeah, he's dead. Do we just go inside? I mean, this is like ridiculous. Fuck, we might actually be able to pull this off, guys. Look at this. This is working out pretty well. Hey, screw you. Let's go. Come on, guys. Move. Do they stop coming? Northeast. Just go. Shit, Gomez and I are pretty solid. We can I think we can do this. Go buddy, go! You got this, man. Charge is set yet? Let's go, buddy. We're gonna go. We gotta go, guys. Gotta get the hell out of here. Dude, that demo guy? Maclepeen? Dude, he's the fucking man. I'm bringing him on a. Like, he did all three towers by fucking set. Well, no. Ng did the first one. And yeah, we didn't hit the fourth tower, but who gives a shit? Uh, all they wanted was three. Let's just get out of here. One down. If both of you can vamanos over this way real quick, just real quick, that would be super helpful. Super, 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 super helpful. Let's just get the fuck out of Dodge, guys. The then get over here.
Dude, Gomez is... She's just stacking bodies right now. God damn. Where in the hell are they? Yeah, so let's go. If it's so clear. If you love the clarity of this area so much, why don't you marry it? Uh oh. Nice! We did it! Yes! We are out of here. Very nice. Nicely done. Use the Rona, guys. Sorry. Nicola, I just got word that the Alpha Strike is reporting all secured. They took heavy losses going in, but having some of the cannons out saved many lives. And one is back to McDonald's Station. One is back to McDonald's Station. Go back. Okay, so we retook the station. I got the Devon Medal of Val Valor again. I've gotten that three times. But I don't have three of them in here. I just have one. Oh, I see. There's a little... Okay, it does show that I've gotten them multiple times. Uh, I'm going to save again. We're going to do phase three, I guess. Thatcher's defense crumbles. SFC officials were forced to admit that the hegemony has now effectively taken over most of Thatcher. Twelve hours ago, hegemony forces launched a massive simultaneous assault against Avila, Nomuro, and Stockton, and overwhelmed the strike force there strike forces there. SFC Commander Walker stated that she wasn't sure of their remaining numbers, but it seems, quote, but it seems certain what the ne their next move will be. They'll fortify Carpaccio Station. It's only the, it's the only facility in Centauri where they can remodel their huge transport ships as limited capacity warships, and it's crucial to their war effort. Carpaccio Station falls. Hegemony forces fulfilled expectations Expectations today laying siege to Carpaccio Station, capturing the important shipyard facility and killing all occupants, including three Centauri Council members, Councilwoman Belinda Walker, Councilwoman Kevin Warfield, and Councilwoman or Councilman uh, Paolo Grimaldi. With the shipyards in their hands, the hegemony now have the capacity to re-outfit the transport ships under their control, turning them into limited capacity warships. Centauri officials agreed that such a prospect does not bode well for the war. Where such ships could cause considerable damage to Centauri targets, the hegemony are Oh, war, where such ships could cause considerable damage to the, to the Centauri targets. The Hegemony are expected to begin outfitting their ships as soon as the war-battered station is repaired. Well, Walker's mom just died. She ain't gonna be happy. Let's see what our kill board looks like. 252. I don't think I did. I don't think I got much higher. But Gomez, man, I told you she was stacking bodies that mission. And where are you? McElpeen? Philip Mountain McElpeen. You son of a bitch. He's my demo guy. I like how this guy, Brant, I Brant Appio, is supposed to be like my uh, brother. And also, mm, I've t he's done 34 fucking drops. But McElpeen with 11 drops? I mean, he just, he hasn't, actually, he was on another mission with me. Yeah, he was the only one left the last time we dropped. We had to take out that tower. Oh, and I brought Ng on that one too. Man, he is just kicking ass. Yeah, I know who I want in my squad from now on. He's my demo guy. The situation has become critical, T. Intel has just confirmed reports concerning the location of the cloning facility on Sarah. This is where the Hegemony are producing their inhuman troops. It is time to strike. The plans we have been sent don't <coughs> tell us much. Standard encampment cloning domes and a control station as for anything else keep your imaginations from running wild nicola i want you to take a squad in and flash the domes demolitions can probably handle it but i don't know what kind of time the situation will allow for you could instead take an electronics handler to force that control station into overload with a little skill and a little luck you could set up a feedback loop to blow the cloning domes sky high let's try that one Again, 
more situation specifics. Let's try that. I'm gonna take electronics here. I'm gonna take gags and then two weapons specialists. The you take to get it done, the more time those domes have to spit out problems. They don't have much in training, but I'll bet they have the basic hunt and kill programming down. Drop off and pick up will be here. And for God's sake, be careful. Dismissed. Yeah, we're gonna try that. Explode a drone. Exploding drone module attaches to a PBS normal drone system, augmenting the drone with a high-powered charge of Petrovsk explosives. This drone is guided like a normal drone, exploding on impact and causing very heavy damage. Note that this system is extremely large and will only fit in the heavy suit. Okay, I don't want it. It's. I mean, it sounds cool, but I'm just not... I want the auto turret. I'm gonna change weapons. You know who I'm going with. You know who I'm... You know who I'm bringing. The certified grade A badass that is Gomez. McElpeen, absolutely. You're my guy. Actually, I don't know if I need to demo anything, but Gags is definitely going to be my... So I'll go with these guys. I may uh, change some of this out. I'm going to change this for the particle beam. Let's give it a shot. And you know me, I'm always paranoid about recording. Uh, no, we're still recording. Okay. Okay, so, pickup point. Cloning facility, control station. We are going to that control station. We're assaulting it. I'm going to get my electronics together to do it. Everybody, follow me. We're going to form up. We're going to fucking take it out, guys. <laughs> this is the dream team. Gerard, well, he's Gags. I, I don't really know how to say his name. It seems like it's possibly French. I'm not sure. Um, so we have Gerard, uh, McElpeen, and Gomez. That is the fucking dream team. That is the fucking dream. Oh my god, these mountains. The bane of my existence. Am I wearing heavy? I think I'm wearing heavy. Yeah, I, I remember. I looked like uh, the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man painted in gray in the dropship, so that must mean I'm wearing heavy armor. Take it out. Macopin, I trusted you. How could you get taken out by a drone? Oh, because they're fucking bombing drones, that's why. Holy shit, we're so fucked. God damn. All right, well. So everybody stick with me. Weapons up. McElpeen, I may leave you behind. I don't know if I need a demo guy, but I could use another weapons expert who can shoot these king drones down. Oh no! Alright, well we know what to try differently this time. Replay mission. Sorry McElpeen, I think I need uh, another weapon specialist. Stedman... Uh... 
All right, fuck it. All right, so we're gonna try this again, control station. Hold on. Everybody on me, let's go. I'm not going over that stupid hill this time, it just wasted so much time. I expect no less from you, Gomez. We drop two turrets to deal with, help us deal with these drones. Oh my god, I tell you, these drones, just like, you can't fight them with this fucking control scheme, oh my god. Just keep my armor intact, that's all I care about. And my squad. Alright, let's move up. Still got eight turrets left, I'm gonna drop a fucking minefield of these bastards out there. You know, fuck it, we're just going for it. Oh god damn. Well, what a waste of time. I may die doing this, but at least we know what to do now. Do not waste time on the fucking... Hold on. How do I get them to target my thing? Cover. Go to retreat, aggressive attack, find cover, assume formation. Follow me. Attack my target. Alt T. Tell 
Take it out, guys. Everybody follow me. Call on the dropship. So, it didn't go exactly- I thought we could do the station- It's too close to the other thing, there's too many explosives, there's no way that the station was gonna survive. No fucking way. Okay. Okay, I thought my weapon system was down. I kept clicking weapon instead of actually trying to switch weapons. Okay, I'm not totally screwed. Health is okay. Shields recharging. Armor looks good. I think we can get out of here. Come on, Gomez. Don't let me down. Guys, get on. Oh my god! Oh my can Dude, fighting these- oh my god, this <laughs> stupid- They're gonna fucking- I'm gonna fucking die from the stupid fucking drone when we're at the fucking pickup point. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Get over here, guys! Take it out, please! Oh my god, I can't target it because I can't look up. Thank you. Gomez, I know you'll drop it. I'll just keep pressing enter till we can go. Well, they're they're basically here. They're basically here. Come on. Yes! Yes, 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 yes. Oh, we did it. Very nice. Okay. Yeah, everybody's fucking hurt. What you've done today may very well be the crucial turning point in the war. Taking care of those domes and putting the damn hogs out of their miserable existence. I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know the odds. It was a very important mission. You pulled it off beyond expectation. With the vats gone, the hogs will have to rely on the clones they've already made since they won't have to churn out anymore. They won't be able to churn out anymore. Well, you say that, I got another Medal of Valor shit. Yeah, they can't put any more uh, lightning bolts on there because I've gotten too many of them. News. Hegemony cloning facility destroyed. A strategic strike by the SFC eliminated the Hegemony's cloning facility on Sarah. The combination clo cloning vat and cybernetic implant facility was disabled by courageous SFC forces. SFC officials were optimistic since the elimination of the factory cuts short the Hegemony's supply of soldiers. They'll have to rely on the troops they brought in from Earth or the ones they've already churned out, remarked SFC Commander Sarah Walker. We'll nail them yet. Alright, so we're going to exit that. Wow, I'm surprised we haven't had a cutscene in a while. 270, 64 assists. Yeah, go, man. Look at that, dude. She's just... Like, all it takes is a single mission for her to just be like, Yeah, girl, don't worry about it. She is fucking badass. But she's probably dead for this mission. Not dead, but, like, injured. The Gemini are packing up and running off with their tails between them. Presently, they are attempting to salvage materials and supplies to ship back to Thatcher. Nicola, you'll be leading a team to Sarah to stop that shipment at the source and keep it from reaching this spaceport here. The hogs are moving in by a convoy to their freight carrier. Today's lesson is simple. Destroy as many of those trucks as possible. I thought you'd like the sound of that one. The road here will take the hedge trucks along the base of this cliff. If you set up at the top of the cliff, you'll be able to fire down on the trucks from above. You should blaze at least some of the trucks before they move out of range. Your other option is to take out the bridge that spans this chasm. It will be heavily guarded.
making this the more dangerous option. But with the bridge out, the trucks will be sitting ducks when they reach the castle. Drop off is here. Nicola, you'll be deciding on strategy. Good luck and happy hunting. I think we're gonna try shooting down at them from the top of the canyon. What do you guys think? That's what I think. Macopine, I want to bring you, buddy, but I'm going to have to bring another weapon specialist. Stedman. I'll give DeWitt another shot. MB cannon. Exploder drone, no thank you. I think what I want is... Auto turret, just in case. Everyone else gets a personal shield. Except for her PB repair pack. We'll see how this goes. This might be a good loadout for everybody. I'm not sure. Oh, I did not want a stupid... I want a particle beam, please. Thank you very much. Actually, you know what I want? I want two MB cannons. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take out all the trucks personally. Intercept, all on me, let's go. Wait, was that already a truck? Did we... So hopefully these guys will just protect me. We'll see how long it takes for the trucks to get here. Oh, damn it. I'm getting out of here. I'm so screwed. I'm so screwed. Where's my pickup point? I want my squad back to on me. I think what we did both objectives uh, destroy all of the convoy and all other foes. Um, well, I mean, we did most of the mission. Who else didn't we kill? Hold on. Well, first of all, I'm gonna get uh, Manolis. Okay, special. Please repair uh, me. You know, I think we're out of here. I kind of want to finish this game up. I don't really see any point in sticking around and... Yeah. I don't really see the point. So, we're going to call in our dropship. We are out of here. Okay. Three rounds left on this cannon. Actually, I'm going to switch to my ASF and drop some turrets just in case. I mean, when we get there. But my suit's okay. Really glad I got uh, brought a suit repair tech along. 
Yeah. For this one time, I'm okay with just those objectives. I want to move to the next... Not that this is going to be super hard, but I'm out of ammo. And as much as I love my squad, I don't... Hold on a second. Are those idiots still over there? What did I say? Where are those goons? Get over here! God. Lucky that wasn't a hot evac. We would have been screwed, guys. Nice show, Nicola. You hit them hard, and they, they're smarting for you. Good to know that we can still show them we mean business. Yeah, I'm the only one who got hurt. You know what I'm going to do, guys? I'm actually going to stop this part of the recording. We're going to do one more episode so that I can, just in case the recording gets screwed up or anything like that, I don't have to replay all the stuff we just did. So... I'm going to go ahead, first of all, we're going to go back to the game here, save, excuse me, save, um, and we're going to do, let's see, end part three. I didn't think I was going to make this more than two or three parts, but this is just for security um, to make sure we don't lose any footage or progress. So that'll be the end of this portion of the let's play or this episode i may combine them i don't know yet it's probably going to take more time than it's worth to render so i may just put up the next episode which is probably only going to be about 15 to 30 minutes because i think we're at the last two or three missions here so um anyways thanks for joining me once again for this let's play and look forward to the finale and conclusion for the next one which will be coming at the same time so <laughs> all right